So y'all wanted me to do this. No, we didn't. Y'all bullied me into doing this. Not a single soul wanted this. No, I, I got receipts. What receipt? Listen, read it. It's all Girl, there. What is this? So this is what we're doing today, y'all. We're doing the max hydration method, popularized by um, this girl right here, I said her name wrong. What? I don't know if she kind of just came up with this or if this was someone else's idea, but that's who I saw. That's the video that I saw. It's for those of us with dry, brittle, old Tommy Pickle, old Steve from Scary Movie, old Tommy and Steve in a dry desert, old. It's for those of us with dry hair, okay? It's to repair and renew and refresh. And apparently it just gives you results that you're blown away by. Here's how it goes. Step one is to clarify. You do an ACV rinse. Step number two, you use a co-wash or a, a mask. Today I'm gonna be using a mask. Step number three is you use a clay mask, which I haven't used in a very long time. Step number four, you apply your leave-in conditioner while your hair is wet in the shower. And step number five is you apply your gel, whatever gel you like. We're gonna get into this thing today, but before we do, a quick message about today's sponsor. Today's video is sponsored by All Black, aptly named that because it's the first and largest streaming platform dedicated to all black content. We got rom-coms, international films, docu-series, original content, all that stuff for $4.99 a month. Or $49.99 a year. Girl, that's $10 off, do the math. From production to performance, all of the content is either written by, directed by, produced by, or acted by people of color. It's super easy to stream. You can do it via your Apple, your Android devices, baby girl. <laughs> Charter. I ain't never heard of that one, but you can do it through that too. This just in, this just in. Monogamy 3. Okay, the long awaited Monogamy 3 is now streaming on all black TV. Okay, listen, the, the description of this thing got me hooked. Listen, four couples on the verge of divorce participate in a mysterious experiment to try to save their marriage. Season three is told in two different timelines, the present, which is the direct aftermath of last season's cliffhanger, and one year later. Girl, sign me up. It come out every Thursday. I also just started Dead Places on All Black, which is about an author who studies paranormal cases. He goes back to South Africa to study one particular case involving his sister who died in a water canal. Spooky stuff be going down on the first episode. Stream where you're celebrated all day, all night, try all black for free for 30 days by going to https colon backslash backslash allblack.tv slash will on a whim. And there you can use the promo code will on a whim to get your free 30 days. Shout out to all black for sponsoring this video. Speaking of that, let's get back into it. First step in the max hydration method is to rinse your hair with the foulest smelling rinse there is, apple cider vinegar. Yes, stinky boots. To make this, I'm gonna add a one-to-one -one mixture of apple cider vinegar and water to an applicator bottle. This one is nice because um, it actually has measurements on the side for precision. Now grab that stinky little bottle and head your booty over to the shower. <gasps> Oh my God, why would you do that? Why would you leave your hair for dead? Two whole weeks with no food, no water. And then you got these little egg water bottles. Praying ain't gonna help you now, sis. Amen. You need immediate help. Oh man, left you for dead. Okay, honestly, my hair isn't that bad off, but it's definitely time for another wash. Oop, where'd he go? Not Instagram, another flawless pic. Girl, starting off with a little rinse, um, Will's Warm Water Rinse TM, where I always start off with a warm water rinse to loosen up any tangles and product. This should take no more than like a minute or so, so like don't be spending too much time here. Here's my hair right before I do the entire max hydration method so that we can compare it to all of the other steps. Let's grab our boo-boo bottle, <laughs> cause that's what it smells like, boo-boo. <laughs> Focusing on my scalp first, I'm applying it here and being so careful not to get this in my eyes because that would be a nightmare. It was scary. This is a straight up liquid, so it's running all down my back, all down my shoulders, so we keeping that head tilted 45 degrees. Ooh, not the pose for the thumbnail. <laughs> now I'm just pouring it over the length of my hair and then squeezing it inside of the section because we did sort of use a large section here. Doing the same on the other side as well. I poured whatever I had left onto my scalp, make sure I don't forget the kitchen. Girl, rip stinky juice. Gone but never forgotten, because how could you? Oh, she passed away? Oh. Mm. Rubbed it into my scalp with my hands, even though my vibrating scalp massager was literally right there. Now where am I Link down below for 50% off. Now it's time to rinse. I worked 
hard, okay? Like any scrubbing floors hard. Azealia Banks is PR manager hard to get <laughs> this stench out of my hair. But as soon as I caught that stench, that stench, okay, I knew it was time to put that thing on Power Ranger. Rinsed for about five more minutes and here's my hair after the rinse. Not that much definition, but soft and pretty shiny. Okay, enough of that. Let's move on to step number two, which is just deep conditioner. I'm using Mask On by TPH by Taraji. It's really thick. Um, um. It's a little tough to spread, but once it's on there, it does a really good job of replenishing long lasting moisture. I gotta keep that thing on for about 10 to 15 minutes and then rinse it out. <laughs> okay, but what do we do in the meantime? We got a whole 15 minutes ahead of us, so. G girl, not time out, I, I guess. I I no looking back. See, now that's an extra 10 minutes. Yup, and no recessed. Quit playing with me, okay? I ain't no substitute teacher. Okay, and it's time to rinse this out. My hair at this point, just like any other time my deep condition is just less frizzy and my curls are kind of like stepping more in line with each other. Like a little moisturized gang. Okay. Okay, a little sisterhood of sorts. Let's put on this microfiber towel, dry off the body, body yaddy yaddy yaddy. Let's go. Okay, I'm out of the shower. It's time to do the little clay. What? The, the clay stuff child is giving Play-Doh. I have never tried this before. This is the Aztec Bentonite clay. Girl, everybody like this. Everybody love it. Everybody scream hooray for this. Indian healing clay. World's most powerful facial. Uh, huh? Mm. That, uh, I think. Girl, I ain't gonna ask no questions. I guess it's um, for the hair too. Um, This is messy. I don't like it because it's messy. It's giving um, Double Dare 3000. It's giving slime. As soon as I open it, a few of the um, park particles hit that, once they hit that throat, it's over. It's it's very powdery. Girl, hold it very steady. It says to mix up equal parts of this and water or apple cider vinegar. No, no, I can feel it. my mouth is drying now. <laughs> One half a cup. Is that too much? I'm gonna do a half of a half a cup because it just seemed like too much. So a fourth of a cup. Somebody ain't doing the math right. One fourth cup in the bowl. Oh! Uh, Y'all ain't see that because it's for, for whatever reason this 4K camera <laughs> don't be picking up smoke. I'm just gonna pour some water in there. Why did I do that without measuring it? Hey clown. Jester, you have done it again. You also have to use a wooden spoon. You can't use like metal or anything because I don't know. I don't know not one thing about mixing it up, child. I don't know why I didn't use the other side of the spoon. A little splatter got on my mouth. Ah! It's giving potions, girl. <laughs> <laughs> it's giving two eyelashes, pig ears, a leaf from the tallest tree in Africa. Okay, I think this is a good consistency, not gonna lie. I hope this is enough, girl. <laughs> Make it enough. Let's take this off. This is not my first time trying bentonite clay, but this is definitely my first time trying this Aztec healing clay. I, I really don't feel like I have enough. In there. Oh my god, my hair still smells like apple cider vinegar. It stinks. It smells like a it smells like beer. Ew, it's so lumpy. It's lumpy, child. It smells like earth. It really do. This is really thick. I thought it was gonna be like dripping all over the place, but no, it's gonna stay in. If it's then it's it's gonna stay in there, period. Y'all be looking like y'all be having fun when y'all put this in your hair. <laughs> Y'all really like this stuff, don't you? When um, Homegirl was doing this one chest, she was like, her curls were like popping and like they were coming back to life and whatnot. But girl, it's, it's giving opposite day for me because <laughs> my hair is just... Now, while you playing, this could be just hair dye because I'm digging this color. What if I went blonde, y'all? I could go blonde. I'm, sis, don't tempt me. Okay, so this ended up kind of being enough, so I'm not even gonna make any more maximum hydration. That's the name of the game. There we go, okay, we got the Aztec clay mask in our hair. That is amazing. Girl, I might as well put it in my beard while we get it. There's no, like, how long do I leave this on? Okay, let's go rinse this out. Yeah, okay. Back in this thing, finna get crunk, hard as a rock, sis. My hair is hard, but it's low-key defined. The mask clearly dries up with a hard shell, but it was surprisingly super easy to rinse out. Just a little bit of warm water, there was no staining on my bathroom tiles, and there was no leftover residue in my scalp or hair. I am shaken in a way that probably requires immediate medical attention. Do y'all see my curls? I haven't been shocked like this since the fourth grade when I stuck a fork in the outlet. Hmm? What? 
it's time for step four. Okay, this is where I'm gonna apply the leave-in conditioner in the shower. Today I'm using one of the best, cheapest leave-in conditioners on the shelf. It's made by Garnier Fructis. This is the Curl Treat Hydrating Butter. Applying leave-in in the shower is way better then adding water later with a spray bottle. Your hair's cuticles are still open from the heat of the shower and your hair is already maximally saturated. So applying leave-in now just keeps all of the water in there. So quick, so easy. It also stopped the drippage, so I didn't even need my hair towel. And last, we made it to the final step, step number five, which is to apply our hair gel. I'm using my favorite Wetline Extreme Gel, taking medium-sized sections and applying thoroughly. Using the prayer hands method, Honestly, as often as I remember to, because girl, I kept forgetting. It really does make a difference. Now we just wait for that thing to dry. Oh, why don't you look at that? It's dry. Listen, one thing y'all not gonna do is catch me slipping. <laughs> Girl, ponte la crema. We had to talk about some things. Uh, hello. First of all, my hair, When after I washed this out, my hair looked different. I've never really done a full clay wash, but after a like deep conditioner, which I liken this to, I've never seen my hair look like that. It was just, I didn't do nothing to it. Girl, I didn't do nothing to her. And she very much was just giving defined, soft, no frizz. Everything was just like working in unison. I don't know if it was just this acting on its own or if it was like the whole entire like hydration method. My hair ain't fully dry right now and the back girl is giving yeah, it's giving yucky. It's giving wet and sticky back there. Even already, this is probably the best wash and go I've ever had. In line. Literally the best wash and go I've ever had. You need to stop this playing. I think sometimes it's fun and fine to go ahead and try some of the trends. Some of the things you gotta use it. Girl, use your brain. Use the thing right there behind your forehead. Forehead ball. Some of these trends are truly wild, but this one is, I'm gonna say, good i really was not trying to try it because listen i don't be trying the trends and y'all be like in my comments and dms like do the hydration method do the hi max hydration method how about you leave oh. yeah how about you go do it yourself but this one is really just a collection of things that i've already tried just in one routine i did the apple cider vinegar rinse that one was scary to me and, uh, and stinky if you don't get the ratio right between apple cider vinegar and water you can kind of stretch your hair out my hair was softer afterwards it just did smell like a after I rinsed that out, I went in with my TPH uh, mask on, and that's always great to me. That's always good to me. It replenished a lot of that moisture. I skipped shampooing. Like, this didn't have a shampoo in the routine. So this was my first time, like, not shampooing, and I'm not mad at it. <laughs> I guess I can go without shampooing for, like, a like two weeks, three weeks. I usually go every single week and I, I shampoo my hair. My scalp isn't like itchy, it isn't flaky. And that's the power of pine saw. It's giving pine what? saw. After that, clay wash scared me a little bit. I thought it was for the face and not for the hair. But when I rinsed it out, I truly could not believe my eyes. I'm definitely gonna be using this like, I don't know how often I should be using this, but maybe like once a month. I don't know, the, the proof is in the pudding. And the pudding is in my hair. Huh? I used my run of the mill cheap leave-in conditioner that I got from Walgreens. It's a goodie, okay? You find it and it's like, wow, this is cheap. The ingredients are good and it also works. And so I recommend you all like try that out. It's, the, it's from Garnier Fruit Teas, which is like, Traditionally, we're like, uh-uh, girl, mm. eh, wrong answer. It's a, it really is good. And then boom, my favorite gel, uh, don't got the best of ingredients. So I am still kind of like on the lookout for a gel that does this good of a job that is just a bit more natural. Like this is given, girl, what's in this? Wetline Extreme Gel just gives me the definition and you can see it. You can see it right here, sis. So my final review of this whole entire thing is that it's a go. It's a go. If you want to try it out, go ahead and try it out. I know I'm super late, sis. So that brings us to the end of this video. I hope you all enjoyed it. I hope you all learned something. If you did, go ahead and give it a big old thumbs up. If you want to stick around, be my friend, be my homie, go ahead and click that subscribe button. Don't forget to follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat. My second YouTube channel will on a way more. And you can follow me on TikTok. You can follow me everywhere. Just don't follow me in real life. 
I done told you once, I ain't gonna tell you again. Hope to see you back here real soon for another episode of Will on a Win, but until then, bye. Oh, no, I did not just smack myself straight in the eyeball, in the cornea. Bye, y'all. Ooh.